As many of you probably know, I spend a decent amount of time looking for projects in their early stages to invest into. This is because early stage investments can have some of the craziest returns and crypto has made these forms of investments far more accessible to normal people like us. One early stage investment I talked about recently was for Pockme, which did a 22x from the private round price and a 9x from the last public round price. Pockme was a French-based project and its success is a sign of a bigger trend of the French crypto markets growing very quickly right now. That is why today I will be sharing with you all another French-based crypto project that has its ICO ongoing. That project is Lord Token and in this video I will tell you all about what makes it special and why it has potential to see some major growth after the token launches. Before I get started with that, make sure to subscribe and activate the bell icon so you do not miss out on more videos like this as well as everything else I post here on the channel and Lord Token is a partner of the channel. So to understand why Lord Token has potential, I have to start with some background information first. Lord Token is going to be a crypto exchange based in France with some other features which I will cover later. This is important to note because right now there are no major exchanges based in France or really even in Europe in general, meaning there is very little competition in the market Lord Token is targeting. If we take a look at the most popular exchanges by volume right now, the majority of them are based in Asia. The reason there are not any major French or European exchanges listed here is because of the stricter regulations surrounding crypto and especially crypto exchanges in the region. You could think of it as a similar to the US where the SEC and other regulatory agencies are very strict with what is allowed. So how will Lord Token succeed where others have failed and become a major exchange while being based in France? To start off with. It is the fourth ever known exchange to cooperate with Binance Cloud. The primary issues with current European-based exchanges is that most of them have shallow liquidity and fake a lot of their volume using market makers. With the cooperation with Binance Cloud, Lord Token will be able to offer users the full liquidity and volume of Binance's own trading pairs directly from launch. This means there won't even have to be a growth period where users suffer from those common issues of high slippage and spreads and low volume. On launch day, Lord Token will be on the same level as the top exchanges in the world. As I mentioned, Lord Token is only the fourth ever exchange to benefit from such cooperation with Binance Cloud, which means Binance Cloud likely sees potential here. One of the other three exchanges to cooperate with Binance Cloud was Toko Crypto, an Indonesian exchange which has gone on to be very successful. Liquidity is nice, but it takes a lot more than that to be a good exchange, but there is no need to worry as Lord Token has plans to stand out in other areas as well. For example, one of the most common complaints with crypto exchanges is slow or non-existent customer service. Even on major exchanges, it can take days or even longer to get in touch with a real person. Lord Token plans to stand out in this area by offering 24-7 support in 17 different languages. In terms of features, Lord Token will offer spot trading for the most popular cryptos, but they will also have some other more unique offerings such as social trading as well as a dollar cost average feature. Additionally, NFT trading will be supported through a native marketplace and there will be early stage investment opportunities made available through a launch pad. Moving on, not only are they working on a platform that will stand out, but the team behind Lord Token is impressive as well. They are already collaborating with five of the top crypto lawyers in France. One of them has been recently named as one of the most influent lawyers in France. Three of those lawyers have been involved in two-thirds of all the regulated ICOs that have taken place in the country, so these lawyers have a lot of experience in doing things the right way in terms of regulation. These lawyers are currently existing the Lord Token platform in its ongoing process to be registered in France. In the meantime, they are currently building legal teams across Europe to take contacts with other regulators in preparation for future expansion. The team is also working with a top crypto communications agency and a big dev team with an excellent track record, not to mention that the founders themselves are also well-known businessmen in France and have been involved with crypto since 2014. Now that you know a lot more about the project, I think you can probably see why it has strong potential. 
When it launches, no exchange in France will have even a small fraction of the liquidity or volume of Lord Token, and it will immediately be a top exchange in all of Europe, and it is the team's plans to expand into other parts of the continent in the future. With that in mind, if you want to invest in the future of Lord Token, you can do so through their ongoing ICO available here on the site. To participate, you will need to register an account, but the process is straightforward and does not take long at all. The LTT token will be similar in utility to other exchange tokens such as BNB and FTT, which have performed well in the past. LTT will be a BEP20 token on the Binance Smart Chain, and it will have a total supply of 2 billion distributed as shown here. The hard cap for the token sale is $13 million, and the tokens will be distributed to investors within 15 days of the end of the sale. Of course, as I always mention when I covered ICOs or other early stage investments, these do have a higher risk than investing in something already established. But of course, with that higher risk comes the potential for high returns as well. As always, do your own research, and nothing in this video is financial advice. As I mentioned, LTT will be an exchange-based token, so if we look at the category on CoinGecko, we can see the market caps of some of the other tokens in this category. If you want to learn more about Lore Token or take part in the ICO, you can do so from the link down in the description. I also linked their Telegram where you can go and join the community to see what other people are saying and get any questions answered. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I will see you in the next one.